Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are covering the uh, unique shotgun called Jake's Hangover Cure. You get this one by stealing it from Jake's bar uh, in the well on New Atlantis. Uh, the only way you can get it is to steal it. Uh, there's no other option. Uh, stealth comes in play here. You can sneak in and grab it if you've got a high enough stealth meter or you can steal it, run outside real quick, uh, drop it on the ground, remember where you dropped it, run away from the area so that you're no longer near it and then get arrested and then you can just go to jail, come back and you'll be able to pick it up off the ground. Um, also I'm led to believe I managed to steal it by stealth but I have seen a video done where they drop it outside and come back and collect it after they've got out of jail so look it up on YouTube uh, if you don't have a high enough stealth level and that is the way you get it it's no difference to the Big Bang um, shotgun it's ex it's identical um, you get physical and energy damage it's a particle beam shotgun heavy fuse ammunition no modifications installed it's a standard white one uh, this is another case where it is just simply a uh, a name you're just collecting a name this one just seems a little bit of a, a a pointless one to me but just my personal opinion but I, I don't know I mean they could have at least made it a blue or a purple thrown some mods on there given us some traits to play with but it just seems like an afterthought of just you know we need one of these so let's just slap it in there but yeah there we go uh, we'll give it a quick playthrough because it's been a little while since I've used the part particle being shotgun so I'll have a little bit of fun with it but for the most part you can get the big bang in more easier places and you're getting the same thing uh, if you're so desperate for a name, then go ahead and steal it. But other than that, it's not really worth it. Again, just my personal opinion. I don't know what level these guys are. Uh, they may end up being a lot higher level than me. i just pick the first people that I could come across. Ooh. One thing I will say about the particle being shotgun is that it does pack a wallop. You can do significant damage with it, but uh, it's the same can be said for the standard one. Um, you definitely can't take anything away from the fact that it is a heavy hitting weapon. It's gonna deal out the damage quite successfully. Uh, it's quite satisfying to use. Uh, let's see if we can find some more. Maybe we'll have to go into this. Hoping for some higher level with a bit of armor so that we can see how it does. somewhere yeah actually in there we go in there and then out here and oh. hello fellas yeah, they're all low level no fun give me something of a challenge oh you're still alive no you're not around me so hopefully we're going to run into somebody with a bit more fire let's just waste that shot and uh, we can get in with a uh, eight clip because that'll make all the difference no it's a good weapon no i'm <laughs> i'm griping but it is actually a good weapon i do enjoy it uh, it's not your standard shotgun by any stretch so it can be quite fun uh it's it's a good blend between shotgun and plasma rifle, if you will. But a uh, particle beam rifle. I don't like you calling it a plasma. Um, because it has both damage points to it. Uh, 
it can excel in multiple areas where as a normal individual would uh, struggle. That was with a bit of armour but he was so low level that it was still a one shot. Uh, also, fair warning, if you can hear clacking, it's my new keyboard. Uh, I do apologise about that, but there is absolutely nothing I can do about it. Uh, they're all low level. This is a bit of a shame. I went to a really high level area as well. target for me to attack. I'm hoping he turns out to be really, really high up. Oh, they killed him. Well, that's not fair. No fun. with the numbers here. Well that was a little better. It took two shots, one to take his armor, one to kill him. So you, you get the gist. Uh, I don't want to take anything away from the weapon, it's not a bad weapon, but when you're talking um unique weapons. It's not unique. It, it's just not. It's a novel idea, giving it a name, but it's not what is uh, what I would classify as unique. A unique weapon for me is something that gives you something that you wouldn't ordinarily come across. And this is literally just a plasma shotgun. Uh, yeah. No. Particle wing shotgun. Run away. See, he told you not to run away. Right back where we were. Yeah, so I, mean, I, I can't really say much more than that. I don't want to slag it off. It's still a good weapon. But I don't think it's worth pursuing um, for anything other than collection purposes. Uh, you can get the Big Bang in so many different places uh, much easier than this thing and probably much earlier on as well that you, it's not really worth it uh, I mean I got it simply because I like collecting and I'm putting together a nice little museum but other than that nah, don't bother uh, unless of course you, you know, want to collect all the different variants of a particular weapon in which case go right ahead explosions. Yeah, so can't really do much more, can't really say much more, there's no point in going round and round and round and round and round. Uh, Jake's hangover cure, steal it if you want it, otherwise just look for a big bang. Uh, that's pretty much all that needs to be said. So, uh, why didn't you reload? That's strange. Uh, we'll leave that one there. Uh, short and sweet. Still entertaining for me. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thumbs up would be appreciated if you did. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And I will see you guys all in the next one. And hopefully we'll get a bit more of an entertaining weapon to go over. Take care.